What's going on YouTube? Might go back with another TTM recap episode. I have a six spot to share with you today. A nice selection of baseball returns. Some of them coming back from this spring. Some of them are coming back from stadiums last year. And a few coming back from private addies. A lot of former players and coaches today. First up today is a one of one success returned in 12 days from Cubs spring training. It is Mr. Eric Hinsky, former major leaguer current Cubs coach. Sahinsky had himself a pretty interesting career. He was Rookie of the Year his first season with the Toronto Blue Jays. Then he kind of bounced around a little bit as a utility player, but he actually found himself consistently on good teams. He was in the World Series at one point, I think like three years in a row. If I'm correct, it was with the Yankees, Red Sox, and of course Tampa Bay. So one of the reasons I wanted to get this Upper Deck card signed, this is a 2009 Upper Deck, which came out outstanding in blue. Um, Hinsky actually made the final out in the 2008 World Series. Brad Lidge struck him out on the slider as the Phillies celebrated the World Championship. So to me, this is a must-have for uh, sort of that Phillies 08 PC. Um, but a very nice uh, return there from Mr. Eric Hinsky. Second one is coming back from Red Spring Training. It's a 3 of 3 success returned in 13 days. This is coming from former Major Leaguer Billy Hatcher. Really nice return. I actually got some back from him last spring. He was with the Phillies for like a short stint when I was a kid. So I had some Phillies cards signed. But I had some other cards uh, this year to send off, including this 1993 Flair, which... Uh, just beautiful cards. Those early 90s, mid 90s flare cards are just absolutely stunning um, to get signed. So beautiful card there in the Red Sox uniform. Also got this 1989 Tops. I'm a big 89 Tops fan. Uh, really the first cards that I ever owned. So that was a cool one. Definitely happy to get that one signed. And also got this 1990 Tops featured in the Reds uniform. Looks really nice signed in blue. So a nice return from Billy Hatcher. So I think that's it for spring training returns. We're going into some stuff that came in from last year. This is a 2016 Tops update. Steve Ciszek. This is a one-of-one one success. Returned in 208 days. Sent this to the Mariners last regular season. Finally came back. He signed it in black. Looks pretty nice. He's been catching up on his mail. I've seen a ton of people get him, including LS cards. So happy to have that return. I actually just sent some Ginters to him like a week ago. All right, next up is a 5 of 5 success. Returned in 157 days. Sent this one to the Boston Red Sox last season. He's current coach for the Red Sox. He's former Phillies player. He played with the Angels as well. And he uh, was general manager of the Phillies for a number of seasons. No one was more critical of some of his moves than me. But uh, he definitely uh, kind of redeemed himself in my eyes a little bit towards the end. He made some really solid trades that look like they're starting to pay dividends. But this 1990 Topps card signed in black, Mr. Ruben Amaro. Got this 1990s U Donruss, the rookies. Always liked this card. Always thought it was a really nice card. Came out really well signed in black. 1992 score, signed in black. Really nice 1992 Bowman. 92 Bowman um, are beautiful cards. They're classics in my mind, so happy to have that one. And finally, a 1993 Topps card signed in black. Really nice card. So a lot of uh, great additions to the Phillies collection. This one was sent to his uh, personal address. He's a former coach in the big leagues. I don't think he's with anyone right now. He played for the Phillies for a brief uh, time in the mid-90s, and he actually technically managed the Phillies for like two days at the end of 2004. Uh, it's Gary Varsho signing this 1991 Fleer card in black. Varsho is a 3 of 3 success in 11 days. Also signed my 1989 Tops for the 89 Tops collection. Really happy to get that one back. And finally, he signed my Philadelphia Signature Collection Custom. Um, these customs guys are available if anyone's interested. I have the Philadelphia Signature Collection, but I also have the Ballpark Heroes. If you guys are interested, shoot me an email. Um, still have plenty of them for sale. 
So let me know about that, but really happy to get that one back from Gary Varsho. And then finally today, this one took a while. This is a three of three success returned in 343 days. It is Gary Reedus. Three of three, 343 days. Gary Reedus signing this 1987 Donruss card uh, in the Phillies uniform. Very brief time with the Phillies. I personally don't even remember uh, him playing there. It was probably in a stretch where I was like five, six years old. So didn't really see him play much. Also signed this 1987 Tops card. So that's another nice one for the Phillies autograph collection. And then finally, he signed this 1989 Tops card. And as you guys know, as I've indicated today, uh, big fan of 89 Tops. And I got a nice pile of them in today. So that's definitely very cool. Um, very happy with the mail day. Nothing mind-blowing like Kershaw uh, over the weekend. But still, nice returns. They keep rolling in and... Check back because, guys, I'm expecting returns every day um, for the next several weeks for sure. So comment below. Let me know what you think of the returns. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Have a great one.